Hey y'all, this is Anna Alexander. Welcome to the living room as I'm watching, I'm watching everything today. It's all being done. <laughs> and that includes episode four of the K-drama series, My Secret Romance, streaming right now on Netflix. And the last episode took these little delightful twists and turns. And I'm excited to see what happens in episode four. So where we left off, Yumi tried to play the I... I'm sorry, you must have mistaken me for somebody else. I don't know who you are, game with Jun Wook. And he was like, ha, huh, please, whatever. Now, he was a little extra cruel in the whole, I'm gonna make her cook three meals for me and then tell her that each one is horrible and awful and give her this huge ass thick book of my preferences and whatnot. A little extra cruel. Cause he said he was humiliated, which I was, okay, so. <laughs> I could see to a point. He was used to getting his way for the most part. Hooks up with a girl. She leaves, but it's not just that she left. Is that she left when they were parked at the beach and took some of his coat, just basically the coat. It was a very nice coat, but he, she just left him there kind of hanging out for the passerbys to stop. And those women were cruel as well. So I could see how he could have been embarrassed at that moment, but totally humiliated? Mm, I don't know, that's a little bit of a stretch. So I'm curious to know why she affected him so much, that encounter. And so, yeah, that's what I'm hoping to find out more. And I hope she gets a little bit more courage to be more confident in who she is as a person. Cause right now she's a little too stumbling awkward still. Like she did have a great little bump of arc when she graduated from school, but now I, I want her to see her be a little bit more. That's what I'm hoping for. So I'm excited. I got my big cozy blanket. I got some little cocktail beverage of choice. It's fine. And uh, <laughs> let's get to it. Some of these titles. <laughs> Are you saying this to him? You should be saying this to him out loud. She should have said that out loud. I know that takes courage. And Yumi does not seem that courageous. She should have said it out loud. Oh. Oh. <laughs> 무슨 일 있으십니까? 없어. He's in need and he needs to speak to a friend. Oh, he went with them. Oh, that's good. 감히 누구더러. 기름 마시고요. 같이 술 먹자더니 무슨 말을 못하게 하는. He gets so angry. 혼나시. <laughs> As if he probably hasn't had, he's had some in the past. You know he has. I suspect he has. Oh, is that her little interview suit? Oh. <laughs> Oh. Hmm. <laughs> He's changing his tactic. This guy. This guy. 오늘은 어쩐 일로 불만 없이 식사도 다 하시고 영양사님께 아주 맛있게 잘 드셨다라고 전달했습니다. 뭐래? 뭐가? 유미 그 여자 말이야. 맛있게 잘 먹었다고 빈 도시락통 보내니까 뭐래냐고. 아마 좋아해? 뭐저 새끼 왜 저래? 저 무슨 꿍꿍이 인간 저거? 라는 표정이었습니다. 아니 말고요. <웃음> 이건가 이번에 새로 맞췄다는 게? 네. 
어떻습니까? 자신 있지만 나 환공포증 있어. Maybe just the jacket with the solid underneath, just to prevent the polka dot on polka dot on polka dot. What's he up to? That was a very devious little smirk. She's a lot. She's a lot. <laughs> okay, so compared to Yumi, she d d does seem really immature, which is saying a lot. She's just gonna walk in without knocking. Personal life, work life, that was on you. You can feel bad about it, but it was on you. <laughs> so how is her mother's marriage? <laughs> Wait, is that her child? What? Oh, so sad. I <laughs> love his clothesline. Whenever. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> so awesome. <laughs> they watched it. <laughs> oh, that's just so mean. Why are they so mean to her? Why does she have it out? Why does she have it out and at the ready? Matcha butchinge. Even at the Oh, Durian. They gave her durian? No. What? Yeah. <laughs> I was hoping he did hear it. <laughs> what is happening? What is happening? What is happening?
가까인 거? 잔말 말고 따라와요. Okay. He likes to manhandle her a lot. Just you can get a little, little, little bit gentler. Is that a Korean executive businessman thing? Or is that this, just this guy thing? 여기는 왜? 생각해봐요. 우리 회사에서 가장 바쁜 내가 굳이 아까운 시간을 써가면서 당신을 여기 왜 데리고 왔는지. I would need more specifics, please. 우리가 그나마 내 입맛에 제일 잘 맞는 집이에요. 먹어보고 공부 좀 하라고 데리고 온 겁니다. They just say that. 뭐 다르게 오해했다면 그 오해 오해 Just 맞습니다. say that from the start. 상상력이 참 남다르시네. <웃음> 보스의 노골 쪽치야. He remembered a lot. <웃음> 고등학교 은사님 딸입니다. 함부로 욕지 말죠. Um, did she know that though? Because she was totally planning on marrying you and saying it out loud. She was manifesting her destiny there. 이유미 씨, 내 <웃음> 전담 영양사 맞잖아요. 그 그거는 그렇지만 오해랑 착각을 자주 하는 타입인가? Yes, it's been established she does. 우리 이참에 입장 정리 제대로 하죠. 공은 공, 사는 사, 과거는 과거. 이유미 씨 말대로. <웃음> 우린 원날씨니까. 장식입니까? 예? 고정문이잖아요. What did he see? 아. 딱지를 자주 하네. 다 big pull cuz she went through the other door. That's what he says. 이 차진욱의 마수에서 풀어줄 수는 없지. 이제 시작인데. <웃음> He really has nothing else occupying his mind. What's in the box? 아직까지 가지고 있냐? Yeah, that's my question. <웃음> 뭐야? 이원진이 갑자기 왜 와? 쌤, 오늘 메뉴 뭐 하실 거예요? 어, 찹스테이크. 찹스테이크로 하죠? 지금 어디서 손님을 구해 와? 돼지고기 있잖아요. 스테이크, 포크, 슈, 세임 띵 우리 맹이사님이 일개 급식업체 따위에게 이렇게 신경을 쓰시는 줄은 제가 미처 몰랐네요 본인 일도 바쁘신 분이 맹이사님 재계약이 다음 달이죠 지금은 일개 급식업체 따위가 아니라 본인 진급에 더 힘을 써야 될 때가 아닐까? 하는 생각이 들어서. What's the kickback he's getting? What would the kickback be? Ah, okay. 명의사님이 원래 천식이 있었습니까? It's a rather subdued suit for Mr. Jing. <웃음> 우리 오늘 너무 고생했는데 
얼른 정리하고 회식하러 갈까요? 나는 빼. 개 모임 가야 돼. What is a kitty party? What's a kitty party, y'all? 동구야, 누나한테 애교 발사! 발사! 누나한테! 누가 그냥 온천 산대니? 생활비 낼게. 그래. 알바라도 하든가. 영화만 안 찍으면 돼. 야, 네 엄마 아직 싱싱해. 지금이라도 맛만 먹으면. 하기만 해봐. 당장이라도 호적 파갈 테니까. 너무 기집애가 또 승질이야. 네 엄마 직업이 배우야. Asterisk, I have thoughts. 그럼 우리 집 들어올래? 내가 침대 하나 놔줄게. 응. 야, 그러지 말고 향 우물만 데리고 가라. 어? 내가 애까지 덤을 하나 얹어줄게. <웃음> 오, 그 전에 스카이. 저 아시죠? 단골인데. 지금 데이트 음. 중인데. 데이트요? <웃음> What? 아, 아니에요, 데이트. 지금 그쪽 되게 방해되는데. 야, 야. 어, 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 너 어, 내가 나 팔지 말랬죠? I foresee lots of misunderstandings with people and places and relationships coming up. Because <laughs> your soul is empty. <laughs> you need to fill your inspiration and your well. Right? Right? 도시락 같은 거 말씀하시는 겁니까? 아, 영양사님도 모처럼 쉬지. 어, 난데. 쉬... <웃음> oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <웃음> 여보세요? <웃음> 방금 누구지? The misunderstandings. The misunderstandings. Here they come. Here they come. To say it was her brother. <laughs> okay, so that was episode four. There's 14 in the series. And that this is where I'm starting to go. Which is, so in contemporary romance, the most common obstacle trope they throw in is that misunderstanding. And it's my least favorite. Because <laughs> the misunderstandings sometimes are way overblown. And I lose interest or I get angry at one of the characters and then I don't care what happens to them. Or it just kind of gets fluffed over and you're like, why was it there to start with? So yeah, the misunderstanding is not my favorite and I am seeing all sorts of little buds of potential misunderstanding conflicts ready to explode. But we did see Yumi get a little bit more confident in herself. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> so Jinwook really is that petty. It's not an attractive look that pettiness, but I did like how he was trying to help her out a little bit and that thumbs up. Super cute, super cute. So I guess we'll just have to wait and watch the next one to see how their relationship progresses. What I'm looking for, what I'm finally looking forward to is that moment when they can just sit and tell the truth to each other about how they really feel and what really happened and what was going on in their minds. So they can come to that understanding. I'm looking forward to that episode with that conversation. And I hope it doesn't disappoint. Yeah, so thank you so much for joining me on this adventure. I do appreciate any time that you have to spend with me. And go ahead and if you haven't, I'd really appreciate if you'd subscribe. So that way you can catch up on other more adventures as we travel around this world. So yeah, <laughs> thank you again. Until next time, y'all.